What I love about HTA is definitely the teachers. Independent learning days. There's so many different curriculums. How different the learning process is. I'm coming to a family. What the board does for Hawaii Technology Academy is we ensure proper governance. Hawaii Technology is a, uh, has four campuses. It's Hawaii's largest charter school. So there's a, a lot that's happening all at once, and we are the body that makes sure that nothing falls through the cracks in terms of legal requirements, policy requirements, or any other compliance. The primary role is as, as a parent. So when I started here last year, I had two kids come here. I, I like to be involved where my kids go to school, and uh, this was a great opportunity to be involved. My daughter actually came to HTA a long time ago, and then I saw my friend had posted that she wanted some people to join on the board. And I thought about how I could contribute as a community member. My background is education. I thought I really believe in the vision of HTA back then, why not contribute now? And even though my daughter does not go here anymore, I still believed in the vision of what HTA provided students. So when it was to join as a board member, uh, they'd have to know that there is a time commitment. This is a state level board. Certainly there's uh, ethics training that needs to happen and there's uh, board governance training, but more important than that, it's a personal commitment to the school uh, and to this community to ensure its success. We're looking for all types of people to join our board. We're looking for real estate agents, people in finance, any type of education background, any legal background, anybody that really wants to contribute to the community and give back. They could expect to serve on a committee that meets their interests and their abilities. We're in the process actually right now as a board to focus on where we want to be in the next three to five years. We have a growing student enrollment and certainly a growing demand, not just here, but all islands where we have a campus. We know that the jobs of today aren't going to exist tomorrow, and the kids that are graduating from HTA are going to have to create those jobs. So how do we best equip them to do that? In light of that, we're looking towards the future. We're looking at project-based learning, but also problem-based learning. We want kids to be equipped to not just to be able to take tests, but we want to be able to solve problems and be able to take control of their own future and create that for themselves.